Hello guys, Survival Tech Nord here. This is just a quick show and tell video. We'll jump right into it and uh, skip all the brouhaha. Hope you like it. Thanks. All right, guys. Here you can see I've got the test jig set up now. And uh, we can demonstrate the problem that we had in the smoke test video. You see that we have voltage at the battery terminals, yeah? Voltage from the pack. But uh, if you look at the fluke here, we have no voltage coming out of the uh, BMS. And the question was, well, the documentation says power must be applied for the BMS to be initialized if there hasn't been any batteries in the pack uh, previously. So every time you take the batteries out of the pack, you need to reinitialize the BMS. So uh, Greek Preparedness and Cliff uh, two of my subscribers were discussing uh, would it be possible for the pack to self-start uh, the BMS itself. Of course, we could do it uh, by initializing the power supply or solar panel, whatever DC source we're using to charge the pack. Uh, but that's a little bit annoying. What we want to do is simply put a momentary switch between uh, B plus and P plus, battery plus, and uh, power plus to uh, initialize the board. So let's do that now. Uh, take a look at the fluke meter. And you see, now we have 16.41 volts uh, through the BMS. The BMS has been initialized and uh, everything's happy. All right, thanks for watching. Ciao.